About 35 years ago, Richard and Carol Foster noticed two crocs in their pond at the Savannah Guest House, next door to the Belize Zoo. One of these crocs was soon to be known as Sam, a female Morlets crocodile. And despite her small size compared to the large 10-foot Morlets croc known as Gilly, Sam was known to be shy yet feisty and aggressive, particularly when people came near her nest or cave. Steve Irwin learned about this during his trip to Belize in 2003 when she almost bit his face for invading her personal space. By crikey, she's a gnarly little Sheila. In March 2019, Carol Foster asked the CRC to adopt and care for the Crocs after her husband's passing. It took nine months for Sam to allow me to get close enough to feed her from tongs, but even then she was very shy. But it was during these brief interactions that I began to notice that she had some issues with her teeth or lack of. One of the reasons we target trainer crocs at the CRC is so we can get close enough and observe any health issues that may otherwise have gone undetected. So how or why during my training with Sam the last couple of months that she has built a bond and a trust with me that allows me to even give her a nice stroke on the head I have no idea, but it's because of this close interaction that I've been able to observe and monitor the issues surrounding her teeth sockets. And it was during a recent training that I realized that Sam was in need of urgent veterinary care, which would likely include a minor surgery.